What's up my lady loves and welcome back to Pokemon X Wonderlock in the last episode We defeated Snorlax on accident. We were supposed to catch him and uh, we did a bunch of stuffy stuff We battled a ton of trainers and now in this episode We're gonna fight our rivals and continue on and maybe get to the second gym town who knows who knows who knows who knows people I don't know you don't know we all don't know all right Well, let's talk to this lady. Let's go with Tiano and travel against butthole and me. Yes, let's do it Let's fight with butthole and me. Okay, butthole since we're all neighbors. We might as well battle together right yeah we might as well battle together you're gonna get wrecked all you guys are gonna get wrecked I love how they get the worst two people against uh, against the best two people it's not even really fair but whatever let's see what the Pokemon they have a Corphish and a Pikachu that's not really gonna be too much of a problem for us because we have Nibble Snarf and Nibble Snarf loves to uh, make the earth shaky with an earthquakey baby here we go let's go for an equate oh man you're not supposed to go before me that's not cool Wow, you go before me too. Okay, kill the Fletchling. Oh man, I'm rooting for my own Pokemon to die. But here we go. Let's go with that E-Quake. Uh, this should kill uh, Corphish and Banana Man. No, it didn't kill Corphish, but I meant whatever. The other dude. I don't even know his name. I can't think right now. But oh, Adriana grew a level. Um, some of you guys are saying that I should probably turn off EXP share. I might if I get too close to level 30 before the second gym, just because I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't want them to be over level 30 because then I won't be able to use them. But yeah, we didn't learn disable or we forgot disable and we learned bite. I totally neglected that that was happening, but that's okay. Uh, he's got another Pokemon. That's not cool, man. All right, well, let's just go for another E-Quake then. And, uh, actually I think... Steel is super effective against that guy. So let's go for a uh, an iron tail do some big damage on him Boom corefish death to you my umbre my friend from another friend I don't I don't get it. Okay. Well nibble snarf grew a level level 23 look at us man We're getting so tough and Simba geez. Okay Simba definitely He doesn't need it anymore. He doesn't need the uh Whatever it's called. He doesn't need EXP share at all, honestly. All right, well, there we go. It looks like we defeated Tierno and Trevor. Look at him. He's like, no more. I don't want any more biscuits. Don't worry, buddy. I'm not going to give you any more biscuits. But next time, I'm going to kill your family. Yeah, that's how it goes. Um, it sure is interesting seeing how each trainer style is different, blah, blah, blah. All right, well, everyone else is heading to Amberette Town. We should heal up our Pokemon, though, because... Uh, last time, I don't know, we took damage and we fought a lot of people, so that means that we need to heal. That's what that means. So let's just walk our way back to this really great, amazing town. It's take, it takes so long to walk in this game because the routes are really large. Not that they're really large, it's just that the game is a lot bigger than other Pokemon games, so... Here we go. Let's head inside of there, and my nose is itchy, and let's heal up our Pokemon. Hello, Nurse Joy. Heal me up, baby. I want you to touch my Pokemon and soothe them with your, with your soothing hands. I want you to touch their parts that are beautiful and private. I don't understand. Thank you for waiting. You're welcome, girl. We hope to see you again. Well, I hope to see you again, too. Not really, though, because then that means that my Pokemon are hurt, and then that would mean that one of them was dangerously close to being gone. Um, some people still can't seem to wrap their mind around that this is still a Nuzlocke. I can't wonder trade away Pokemon and my Pokemon when they're dead they're dead like I can't I can't use them anymore I have to release them or put them in my PC whatever happens happens I don't know but uh, yeah now we can continue on this way after fighting those two people hello a cave um, well we can catch a Pokemon in here so let's do it let's catch a Pokemon in this placey place connecting cave Zubat roost oh there's a person there well let's catch uh, let's catch a Pokemon before we fight or not before we fight, but before we do anything else. Let's switch out to Bob Hole. Man, you were getting underleveled. I didn't even notice that, to be completely honest. Uh, come on. Let's get a wild Pokemon. All right, let's see what we get. Hopefully something that won't die to us in one hit. Our Wishmer, really? All right, well, I don't really know what we're supposed to do here. Uh, we don't have any, like, paralysis moves or anything, do we? Maybe I can go for, like, a pound or something. I'll go for pound. Maybe quick attack would have been a better... A better bet. Okay, pound is not bad. That's good. Okay. Let's go for one pound and Bob Hole, do not freaking kill him. If you do, I will cry. Please. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Okay. Well, that means that we should be able to catch this Wishmer with the Great Balls that we purchased in the last episode. So let's go ahead and get those out here. A Great Ball. Oh, yeah. Great Big Balls of Fire. Let's just throw this at this baby Wishmer. And hello, friend. You are going to get caught, aren't you? Two? Three? Yes! Okay, we caught Wishmer. Awesome. Alright, so now we need to Wonder Trade him away, and we can get a new Pokemon. Ooh, ooh, 
Ooh, exciting. And we grew a level from that. That's... That's also exciting. All right, the rest of our team gets EXP from the EXP share. That's cool. I like EXP share, even though a lot of you don't seem to like the EXP share. I like it, but, I mean, my Pokemon might eventually get overleveled, so that's always a problem. That's always a big, big problem. All right, well, uh, let's connect to Wi-Fi really quick. I probably should have done that before I started off the episode, but, ah, eh, you know me. I'm not really thinking. Um, but I'm really excited to start, start, I'm really excited to start uploading twice a day. Um, the reason I haven't so far is because my Sony Vegas has been glitching out on me and I had some graphics card problems, but I got it all sorted out. I figured it all out on my own and I feel like a little genius. Yeah, I figured it out and, um, yeah, that, that's not going to give me any more issues. So I should be able to record and upload, uh, a lot more frequently for you guys. And also Pokemon Glaze should be continued pretty soon. Sorry for the delay on that, but let's see this Psyduck. Oh, it's Turd. All right, well, let's trade away this Wishmer. Hopefully, we get something good, something worthwhile, something that's not garbage like that Psyduck was. That Psyduck was complete garbage. All right, searching for a trade partner. Please wait a moment. I will wait a moment when you wait a moment. I need to start recording more episodes on Wednesdays. That's 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 just what needs to happen. All right, come on. Let's find this trade partner. I, I mean, it was really fast, um, like, finding someone to trade with when you first start started playing the game does that make sense no it's uh it was faster whenever the game first came out because everybody was wonder training it was a cool new feature and everybody was like hey, i gotta do it and then yeah that's what happened everybody started doing it in the booty does that make sense that makes sense oh look we got a benelby i'm not gonna use it i'm <laughs> really not gosh what is up with these pokemon that we're getting i can't really complain though because i trained a wishmer but Hey, a Benelby, and it's Japanese as well. We gotta, we gotta think of funny names for these guys because Benelby's not a funny name. All right, well we got that done and out of the way. Let's continue on and fight this lady, lady. How well have you raised your Pokemon? Let's have a battle, and I'll let you know. Please let me know how well I've raised my Pokemon, because I feel like I've raised them really well, but I might not have because I'm also a grandma. You are challenged by Breeder Mercy. Okay, well, a ducklet, that's not going to be too much of a problem for us. We do have a lot of electric-type Pokemons, don't we? No, we don't. I think we have two, actually. Um, but, um, what should we go for here? Let's go ahead and switch out Pokemon, though. I don't really want to use Bob Hole on this guy. No, I mean, he's only level 12. Okay, we'll stay in, and we'll go for some quick attacks really quickly here. Mm, boom, get hit in the face with attacking. That is quick. That is quick of attack. Man, that did nothing. This is really doing nothing. But I don't want to switch. I don't feel like switching. I don't feel like going through the animation. So here we go. Let's go for another quick attack. Bob Hole, I need you to get a crit, buddy. I need you to do more damage than this, Bob Hole. This is, this is sad. This is depressing. All right, one more quick attack. And yay, I killed it. All right, Ducklet's dead. Finally. Goodbye, Ducklet. I loved you. Not really. I never did. I thought you were gross. Ooh, Pidgeotto grew a level. Uh, that's nice. And she's going to go on with Pikachu. Um, you know what? Let's switch into Nibble Snarf. I mean, you can never have too much Nibble Snarf. Plus, the guy's going to evolve pretty soon, though. I mean, level 25, I think, is when he evolves. <laughs> so that's pretty close. All right. Well, hello there, Pikachu. I love that they make it say its name. I, I wish they would do that for all the Pokemon, to be honest, rather than the cries. I mean, I like the cries, but I think that is a lot cooler when they're like, I'm bigger, bigger. It's much cooler. Why is my nose so itchy today? I don't understand. Don't understand. All right, well, there we go. Equake took that guy out. Not a problem. And look at that boosted EXP. Andy Mulga grew a level. Electro Ball? Um, I don't really know what you have. Shockwave? That's good. Um, uh, Spark? That's physical. We can get rid of that. I don't know if he's physical attacking or what's going on here. But my phone will not stop ringing. Let me just throw this in the floor. Uh, let's see. All right. They're about to send out Lit Leo. Who should we switch out with? Let's go in with Bob Hole because that's... Ah, my nose! It's going to be the only person that we can actually do something with. Or not do something with, but we finally found someone he's super effective against. My nose is so itchy today, people. I don't understand why. Why is my nose itchy? I'm going to bite it. I'm just going to bite it off. But anyway, let's go for a water pulse on this Lit Leo. Should be more than enough to take this guy out in one hit. Uh, to be completely honest, yeah, 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 he's dead. He didn't stand a chance. All right, we get barely any EXP from that. All your Pokemon are level 12. Why do you Pokemon suck? All right, Oddish, let's go in with Adriana and just go for Poison Sting since we haven't used uh, Adriana in quite a while. We really haven't. It's been quite a while. 
All right, so here we go. Oddish, um, that's still not going to be any problem for us, buddy. I'm sorry. Look at Adriana's face. I forgot how beautiful it is. It's like, I don't give a crap about your family. I don't give a crap about your dog. I'm going to sting you in the butthole. Well, do it. Just do it. Just sting us all in the butthole. Ah, there we go. That's better. Um, finally, finally, finally. Oh, people, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you totally should. Um, I got my 100k silver plaque in the mail, finally. It took like a year. Honestly, it really did take a year. Uh, but I got that in the mail, and it looks awesome. And I posted a picture of it on Instagram. Um, all those kind of links are down below, though, so you should definitely check those out. But, uh, yeah, so that was, that was really cool. I wasn't expecting to get it in the mail. I kind of forgot about it. And then one day, I just walk into my front office and they're like hey we got a package for you and there it was it was really it was really cool all right well what else is in here a lot of strength areas all right well we don't really want to do anything with these guys and let's see if we can get out of here without running into a wild pokemon <laughs> that timing though all right let's see what you are a wishmer oh look at its mouth it kind of looks like an anus i mean that's kind of gross but it does Look at it, it's like, wah, wah, wah. Uh, it's, it's so nasty. All right, let's just run away from Wishmer. It's disgusting. It's possibly one of the ugliest Pokemon I've ever seen in my life. All right, well, let's get out of this nasty little cave. We spent way too much time here. I just wanted to battle somebody, but that didn't really work out the way that I wanted it to. Looks like we're going to have to head up Route 7, though, because uh, we can't do anything in the cavey cave. You know what? I'm going to put down a Repel because I don't want to run into any Pokemon in this route, and we've already... We've already basically screwed ourselves over on catching a Pokemon here, so yeah, I can just use a repel and be fine, right? Right, okay, and there's an item down here. Awesome, a tiny mushroom. I think you can give those to people who will trade them for moves or something like that. I don't really remember, and I don't know if they have those in this game, but in the old games, not in the old games, but in some of the games, uh, you can trade items and stuff. I don't even know what I'm saying. All right, a scientist lady. Uh, are we good with Bob Hole? Let's just go with Bob Hole, I guess. All right. Oh, you don't even want to fight me. Hello. How about if I help your Pokemon rest? Wow, that would be very nice. Thank you, lady. She's so good. Thank you. Oh, such a sweetie pie. Such a sweetie pie. Anyway, now we are in a another new route here. We are in Route 8. Listen to that music. Stop right there. Who are you? Please be a boy. Oh, you're two people. Okay. Ah, ha, ha. We didn't mean to surprise you. How are your Frogadier doing? Uh, well, he's great. Haven't you wonder traded or wondered wonder traded? Oh my god. Haven't you wondered how a single Pokedex could possibly fit a region in as big as Kalos? Well it can't. Okay, well there's three little separate regions to uh or three separate Pokedexes to this this game. I know it's kinda weird, but uh it's a pretty large game, so I don't know. They have each little each little side, the left, the center, and the right, that's all sides. That's three sides, isn't it? No, I don't know if you'd consider center a side, but Whatevs, mate. Whatevs. Uh, let's head down here. I don't know what is down here because I've forgotten. Nope. Okay, we went the wrong way. Let's go back up, and we're going to go to the far left. I think there's something over here that we can that we can get, that we can pick up. I don't really know. I feel like it's in this rock. Nope, nothing's in that rock. I'm insane. Asylum. Ooh, hello. Hello. An item. I was right. An HP up. That's pretty good. I mean, that's worth it to go and pick up. So let's see what else we can get over here. Is there any more items? I really love this route though. Listen to the music. It's so, it's so, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It gets you pumped. Like it, it feels like you're gonna do something great. I don't know if that makes any sense to you guys, but to me it does. All right, well, anyway, we got our first wild Pokemon in this route. You guys know what that means. That means we gotta catch it. And that means that we gotta wonder trade it away. So let's see if we can catch this wonderful little Inke here. Hello, buddy. Uh, Inke, I'm just gonna, aren't you ghost type or something? I don't even know. Let's just go for a quick attack. And see how much damage that does to this guy. That did nothing. Okay, that's good, though. We want it to do nothing because we want to capture this guy. We don't... Whoa. That did a lot of damage. All right, well, let's go for another quick attack here. Get him down into the yellows. Uh, I think we can go for one more quick attack and we will be absolutely fine. So here we go. Quick attack, please. Okay, that did good. Okay. It scared me because it got to red really, really fast. All right, so let's get in our bag here. And let's go for a Pokeball. Actually, you know what? Let's go for an Ultra Ball. I want to be super duper sure. So, all right. Let's take some Ultra Balls. Take him in the face. Oh, yeah. Okay. You got to get caught. You got to do it. Okay. One, two, three. Come on. Where's the fourth one? Yes. Okay. We caught Inke. That means that we have another Pokemon to Wonder Trade away. Yes. That means we got two Pokemon in this one episode. I'm pretty excited. And Inke is not a bad Pokemon to trade away. So, let's hope that the gods of Pokemon give me some little Karmid. Carmen, Karma here. Give me some uh, advantages, and let's name him uh, 
Duck, because he's not a duck. <laughs> I don't know why we would name him Duck, but it's a cute little name. It's actually a girl, so, uh, yeah. We got him, though. Duck has been transferred to box one. He's adorable. She's adorable. All right, well, let's wonder trade that Pokemon away without any further ado, because we want some new Pokemon, and I really want to uh, replace this Emolga. I don't want Emolga. I really don't. All right, do you want a wonder trade? Of course we do. Let's go ahead and pick up this Inkay really quick and trade it away. All right, now we just got to search for a partner and find it. I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far because, honestly, this has been the most fun I've had Let's Playing in such a long time. I love this wonder lock, and I love the feedback that you guys give on it. And it's really exciting to see you guys come back and comment on my channel, even though I've been gone for so long. So... Really, thank you guys so much for all your support. So here we go. We finally found a partner. Woo! All right, buddy. What do you have to give us? Please be something good. Please be a shiny. That would be really cool. What if we got a shiny Pokemon from a Wonder Trade? Oh, my God. I would crap my pants. <gasps> a Snorlax! Oh! <laughs> ah! you got to be kidding me. I got a Snorlax. Oh, my gosh. Okay, that's great. That is great. Next episode, I'm going to replace... Um, I'm going to replace one of our Pokemon for him. I cannot believe I got a Snorlax. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, my gosh. All right. Well, we got to go check this out very soon. I want to get back to the freaking PC as fast as I can. That is amazing. We got a Snorlax, everyone. Oh, my gosh. Ah, it's exciting. Dream big is what I say. You're looking at the future champion after all. Yeah, you, you are looking at the future champion right here, man. Right here, lady. I mean, why, what's up with all the upskirts and the butt shots with the new Pokemon games, man? I don't like it. I really don't. There's so many butts. I don't know if you guys have noticed. I feel like I might be the only one who's noticed. But seriously, there's a lot of butts. There's a lot of butts. All right, well, you know what? I'm going to switch out to Simba because Ice Fang is super effective against Axew. And I'm kind of scared, honestly, at what this guy can do to my Frogadier because he's pretty low health. And I, I just, I don't want to risk anything. So, all right, Scary Face wouldn't have done too much to us. But still, I mean, I don't want to lose any of my Pokemon. Look how angry Simba looks. He's like, you murdered my family. You didn't, but you're going to die. Yeah, see, look at that. That's why I switched. I knew he had that stupid move. Here we go. Ice Fang does good damage, though. Yeah, good enough to freaking kill you, Axu. Get out of town. Get out of here. No one wants you, man. And Adriana grew a level from that. Ooh. Hopefully, we get a Moonstone pretty soon because I would honestly love to have a Nitto Queen. I really would. All right, but we defeated uh, that Lady Man thing. I don't even know what you are, really. You're a you're a tranny. Yeah, I love trannies. They're the best. I don't really. I don't know why I said that out loud. All right, Trainer Taps, you can change the position of Pocket Bag by holding your butthole. Well, I will remember that next time, and I will hold my buttocks. My buttocks. My buttocks. Okay, I don't know what I'm saying, but let's head right down here and talk to this dude. According to my production, this victory is all mine. I'll put them to the test. Put what to the test? What are you trying to say? Your Pokemon are better than mine? My Pokemon are wonder traded, all of them. And they'll beat you, except for the one that I'm leading out with. Yeah, but... Other than that, I don't even know. All right, well, whatever. Let's just go out with Frogadare Dare. And uh, Water Pulse should do fine. Should do fine against this guy. I think it'll do good enough damage. So here we go. Let's do that. I don't think it'll kill it, but I do think it'll do good damage. So there we go. And almost killed him. I mean, that's not not too bad. I'm not complaining about that damage. One more Water Pulse will be enough to take him out. Wow, look at Bob Ho. He's like grooving. He's like, yeah. Yeah. I like what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Well, there we go. Pancham is done. Down for the count, baby. And Simba grew to level 25. That is nice. He is looking really strong. And we got Skiddo coming out next. Uh, you know what, guys? Let's go ahead and go out with Pidgeotto. Just because the um, the grass type versus the flying type. You know what I'm saying. That's just, he doesn't have a good advantage against that. So here we go. Skiddo, you're not going to be too much of a problem, hopefully, for us. So let's just go for an Air Slash. And that should do more than enough to take down this beautiful little goat. Oh, goodbye, friend. You're done. You're out of here. You're out. Get out of town. Get out of the city. Get out of the state. Get out of the country, buddy. Oh, gosh. I'm so mean. All right. Well, there we go. We grew a level to level 25. Look at us. We are getting really, really high leveled. Uh, Bob Hole, should you learn a move? Did he no. I don't want to learn round. I don't know why. I just don't want to learn it. But there we go. Not learning that. And now he's going to send out Gold Dean. Um, let's go in with Nibble Snarf just because he's still sitting at level 23. We don't really want him to become under leveled at any point because he's beautiful. Like a diamond in the sky. All right. Well, Nibble Snarf, I believe in you. I believe in your ability to uh, earthquake. So let's do it. Let's make the earth shaky with an earthquakey, baby. Here we go. Boom. Kill that fish with earthquakes. 
That is done. Yeah, you're you're done. You're just you're, you're out of here. Get out of here. I feel like an umpire when I'm talking. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. I'm just I'm still so hyped up about that Snorlax. <laughs> that certainly didn't go as my predictions stated in my pants. Well, that's true. Hello? Hello. What just I did I, I level 24? I thought it was level 25. Oh, well, regardless, uh Nibble Snarf is evolving. That's great. That's awesome. That means that we're going to have a Gabite. I mean, he's going to be even stronger. Oh, God. Look at this guy. Oh, Gabite is so cute. Ah, look at it. It's like a little short, stubby dragon. Ah, it's adorable. I love it. I love it. You are so cute. Oh, we're learning Dual Chop. That's a good freaking move. All right. Let's see. It's Dragon type, too, uh, by hitting two strikes in a row. Should I get rid of something for that? I feel like Outrage is good, though. I don't I don't want to get rid of anything for that. I'm going to keep my moveset. I kind of like it. All right, let's give up on Dole Chop. I'm sorry if it was stupid. I just like Outrage. I think it's good. 120 attack is pretty darn good, if you ask me. Um, let's see. Uh, Nibble Snarf, look at this. <laughs> ah, you're so cute. <laughs> He's so cute. I love it. He's adorable. All right, well, let's <laughs> stay in with Bobble, I guess. I, I didn't know who we were who we were leading off with. Blah, I'm so excited about this. Okay, well now we can go down a this way and there should be some hoppy hoppy places. You know what I'm saying, people? Or is that is that not over here? Oh, there's a fighter guy. Um, let's, ooh, I, I don't really want to use Bob Hole against the fighting type Pokemon, but whatever, we'll just, we'll just do it anyway. We'll suck it up and we'll just do it. We'll just, we'll just do this. We got this. My Machop and I will walk these mountain paths with our bare feet. Do you think you could take us on? Yes, I do think I could take you on. I think I could take you off, man. I think I can take your panties off. You know what I'm saying, ladies? No, I'm saying... <laughs> God, what is wrong with me? All right, well, let's just go with Bob Hole. Enough talking about taking panties and all that stuff. Let's see how much a Water Pulse does to this guy. I'm kind of scared. Level 20 is a little tough for us, so... Uh, yeah, one more Water Pulse should be good. Never mind, he used Foresight. What an idiot. Okay, no one wants... Why would you use Foresight against a Water Pokemon? I don't know. I don't really care. It made us be able to kill him without getting a scratch on us, so there we go. Let's just go for another Water Pulse. That's good game to you, Machop. You should have... You should have listened to your trainer. You should have done something smart. How is a level 20 Machop only give 260 experience? I don't understand that. Whatever. All right, well, let's get the item that's hidden in this rock. I think there's one hidden in that rock. Is there one right here? What was the point in fighting you? There was no point. Ah, well, okay then. I don't like you then. Uh, let's just go down this way. I don't want to run into any Pokemon. We didn't run into any. Uh, let's see if... I don't think there's any more trainers for us to fight in this route, to be honest. I think we might have fought them all, but I'm not 100% sure. All right, we're going to go back and get that item, though. Let's go grab it. You just need to go over here. Do the hoppy hoppy, and hello, friend. A leaf stone. I wish you were a moonstone, but that's fine. A leaf stone's good. Never know when we um, when we might actually need that, just because this is a wonder lock. So every item is going to come in handy eventually. I come in handy every day, right? Right? Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. All right, let's head down. We should be getting close to Amberette Town, somewhat close at least, I think. Yeah, we're here. All right. Well, we made it to Amber Amberette Town. Hi there, neighbor. Who are you? Identify yourself. Oh, you're the lady lady. All right, what's up? This is Abrata. You can go to the city aquarium to get to sell silver, whatever, but we should go to the fossil lab and have them tell us about fossils. We might even learn something about the mysterious stones related to mega evolution. Ooh. Ooh. Are you sure about that? I don't know, man. That's, uh, that's, a, that's a big deal. That's a big, that's a big biscuit. Um, well, actually, we can get a Pokemon here, too, since we can wonder trade away a fossil Pokemon. So it looks like we're going to pick up a Pokemon here as well. But before we do that, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. We took took some damage, people. We took some damage. Let's just heal up. Good morning. Oh, welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like to rest up your Pokemon? Yes. Yes, I would. Why wouldn't I want to rest up my Pokemon? I want them to be full health for whatever is on the way. And for some reason, the audio is only playing through my right ear. I don't know why, but there we go. Um, you know what, guys? This has been a pretty long episode, but I'm going to go ahead and end it here. If you have enjoyed the episode, oh my gosh, voice crack. If you have enjoyed the episode, go ahead and leave a like down below and a comment as well. And whatever you feel like, guys, it's really just awesome to see your support and your feedback. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I will see you all next time.